I think the best one would be uh, my new one, This World Start on Vision. I never not play in a set is um, uh, Time by G. Jones. It's a half time and it's, it has that section right before the drop where everybody think that you forgot to like drop the bass and then the real drop comes in and it's like every time like a big big reaction. I think it's been uh, The Black of the Berry by Kendrick Lamar. The album to work out would be Bright by Joe Wright. It just has that like a beat, uh, full of energy, and it's it drives you just just crazy. So I like that one. I'd say Exodus by Noiser because yeah, it has it's from the very early days of like harder. Um, a very technical drum and bass. I'd say my, my new one, Modern Intimate. <laughs> Biggest banger. Ah, um, man. It's a uh, ring shifter by uh, Mephus. I think it's like the gnarliest drum and bass tune that's been ever made, honestly. <laughs> Easy, it's my track, Shaylard, that's on uh, New Signal, because it has that weird second part with a techno build up, but it's not, it's not like you're not like dropping down the BPM, it stays at 172, but it has like a weird uh, syncopation in the rhythm that makes it a techno beat. And then like there's like so many DJs that have been trying to mix that one, but then fail to like catch up with the second proper drum and bass drop. <laughs> Highest in the Room by Travis Scott and Rosalia and Lil Baby. I like it when Rosalia just used that completely weird uh, over the top auto tune on her vocal. It's just, it, it sounds like off, but it just like catches your attention some way. It's the second part. The, the best song to end it is the second part when you release Modern Intimate because. It's a different BPM, so like people have been like rinsed out with like drum and bass stuff or like 170, 150, 140. And then you come up with that 100 BPM half beat trap thing with like very emotional vocals and shit. And it's also very progressive, so you can like literally just like leave the whole song playing. And yeah, just people like to vibe at the end of the set to, to that track. Man